Okay, so what you want to do is get a black, well it's a makeup pencil like this that I got from Walmart. What you're going to do is you're going to want to trace around the eyeball because you're going to want to cover this all black. So just trace around it like this. And don't worry if it's messy because you can always touch that up with the makeup. See, just like that. And then you're going to go ahead and trace the nose also, but leave like a gap. Like I'm going to leave like a gap just like this in between the nose. So what way it looks like it's split. So just, just trace around your nose. Just like that. See, just like that. And then go ahead and um, take some black um, makeup, liquid makeup, and go ahead and cover your whole inside of the eyelid. Okay, so what you're going to do is what I went ahead and did is you're going to take um, a red crayon, just like that black one, and you're actually going to draw little circles around the whole eye. Kind of like rose petals, just around, you know, your whole eyelid. I mean, because I went ahead and did a flower around there. It's any preference, any range design that you want to do. It's free range. But I went ahead and did the red flower, so I'm going to go ahead and do that around your whole eye. And then, I actually was recording, but it cut off. But what you're going to do is you're just going to fill in um, the red circles, um, a liquid eyeliner, and actually go over those, trace those little circles to define it more, just like this. Just to make them look like... Okay, after you went ahead and traced the, rope, the petals, what you're going to do is you're going to put little lines in it to actually make it look like flowers. So you're going to just do this. Just going to go ahead and define the petals. Okay, and you're going to take this red crayon again. And you're going to go ahead, we're going to finish this top little sun thing, flower thing. And then you could draw anything up here, like I said again, you could draw a spider web and anything your preference, but I just went ahead and did like a little flower sun and just trace that back up to the forehead. Just like that. And then go ahead and draw the little petals on. Go just like that, and then fill these in red. Just fill these in red. Just be careful not to get inside the flower because you don't want it to look like like your eyes join to the top of your forehead. You don't want that because that's not pretty. So 
Then what you're gonna do is go ahead and take um, the red, the red paint, and just fill that in so it doesn't look so so clumpy. I'm just using a Q-tip just to fill it in. And you can use a sponge or a brush or whatever you have with you, whatever is handy. Just a so. And then go ahead and take the yellow crayon and fill the rest of it in yellow. Just don't like the way this face white face makeup sticks to my face. It feels like glue. It just feels funny. Okay, then what I did I just got the after I filled everything in, I just got the black liquid eyeliner and then just traced it to like more define it. And so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna work on the bottom right here. Um what I'm gonna do is take a green um eyeliner pencil. Doesn't matter what kind. And then I'm gonna go ahead and draw like little leaf things right here. In the shape. You can't really see it's like real light. Uh -oh. 